What's going on? This is Inspector Tech on Studio Life 10X reminding you to like, comment, and subscribe. We trying to do it big, and I got a special episode. Oh, my goodness. We're going to be dealing with the Rodecaster Duo. Yeah, you heard that right. Mm -hmm. And this is a different type of video because I've never done this type of video before. Now, and I've never seen this type of video done before now when i tell you this you're gonna be like man what this guy is super crazy <laughs> that's right i am listen what we get ready to do is we get ready to jump into an unboxing that's right i they just sent me this i'm unboxing it and now i'm reacting to my own unboxing video man that's crazy right there you know what i'm saying you see this right here i got it from bnh yeah yeah you see me pointing to it yeah that's because i like that you know what I'm, saying? I'm like that holla at your people you dig Okay, so now what I'm doing right now is I was looking for a knife. I couldn't find a knife. So I got this scraper. I don't even know what the name of this scraper is, but hey, I just got this scraper and I'm opening this box with this scraper. And man, we getting ready to reveal an awesome piece of technology. Look, man, I got the ashiest hands on the earth. It's like I was slapping a box of powder. Man, what in the world? Put some lotion on your hands, man. Oh, my goodness. This is ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? I can't. I'm not going to take this. Oh, man, look at that. Roadcaster duo. Oh, my good. Oh, man. It, man, why you got it flipped upside down, man? Pull it up out the box. I got to pull this thing up out the box. Oh, my. Look at the turnaround. Look at that Roadcaster duo. Oh my goodness, that is a piece of beautiful technology. Look, it was it was all gritty on my hand, but I'm telling you, the Rodecaster Duo looks so nice. You know, I had to hit you off with the packaging. Look, man, Rode, y'all do a good job of packaging, man. Can't nobody package like the Rode people. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, holla at your people. Revolution preamps, Apex processing. Oh my. G double O D. You know what I'm saying, man? Road, y'all be doing your thing right there. You know, I'm telling you, the road box of the Roadcaster Duo is beautiful. You see all the specifications. In this video, I'm not going to give you all the specifications, but I got them in my mind because I had to study them. You know what I'm saying? Oh my goodness. Look at that. Pe mm -mm -mm. I'm telling you, it's so beautiful. You know what I'm saying? So now what we get ready to do is that I'm getting ready to just rip this thing up out the box. And when I rip it out the box, this is what I want you to do. I want you to just marvel at this um, Rodecaster Duo because it looks great. It looks like it's, you know now, the Streamer X, that 4K capture device, it looks like the Rodecaster Pro 2 and another Rodecaster Pro 2 had a baby, right? Now, this Rodecaster Duo looks like a small little brother of the streamer x you got what i'm saying if you don't know this is the streamer x you know i got a video on it hey man look at it i'm talking about the settings and everything quit playing you better go look for that you know what i'm saying look at that look at this box though this box looks very nice oh man i'm pulling oh my good come on man you gotta look oh you the next level audio yeah you know i'm just saying and I am speaking to you right now on the Rodecaster Duo. Mm hmm. That's right. Look at that. Next level audio. We can ready to pull this duo out. Ooh, look at the blast. Oh my god, there comes the Wow. Wow. It's looking all great when you pull it up out the plastic. You know what I'm saying? Look at that right there. You know, so look, you see that right there? Oh my goodness, this is crazy. It's really nice. You know what I'm saying? So uh, you see the pod mic, you see the NTH 100s, you see the, the boom arm. Now, when you pull that, when I was pulling this Rodecaster Duo out of the packaging, I was very excited and very happy. I mean, happy that. I was just looking at this nice piece of technology. Yeah, you gotta get that out the way. Now, you'll see that it has a USB-C to USB-C and this right here that I'm pulling out right now, this is the adapter. The adapter to the Rodecaster Duo. Of course, that's that little small user guide and has a couple of the specifications. This right here, of course, is the USB-C to USB-C cable, high-speed cable that comes in the packaging with the Rodecaster Duo. Now, I'm trying to get this 
adapter out of the box, man. It was so difficult to get out the box, man. I was getting ready to rip the box open. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, man, I got anger issues. You got what I'm saying? I'm telling you, man. I was like, what are they doing? Good job, bro. Good job. You're, you're, you're great right there with the packaging right there. Okay, so now you see the outlet adapter, the Rodecaster Duo, the little packaging that it comes that comes with it throw it out the way man throw it out the way man why you got all these tattoos man what you doing man the graces man what you what you up what what kind of time you on right now you know what i'm saying so now watch this right here okay so i'm, I'm of course i pulled the plastic off of the um roadcaster duo and now what i notice is that this is a quality assurance card yeah quality assurance card it said hey yo man we inspected this thing right here and hey it's good to go i was like hey that's all right man so john and kim hey we really appreciate you you know so the rollcaster duo that i have right now it was manufactured or released or the quality assurance was certified in january of 2023 i think january the 18th of 2023 very happy about that yeah very very happy about that you got what i'm saying i'm like hmm okay this is what we do but you know this is what we're gonna do i had to show you the unboxing i'm just messing around with the rollcaster duo right now you know filling on the buttons and all of that type of stuff because you know that's what i do man you got to do that too once you get a new piece of technology hey you got to fill around with it you got what i said but this is what we're gonna do we get ready to transition to an aerial view of this rollcaster duo and that's a, that's how we're gonna roll with it you know that's how we're gonna roll oh look at that great piece of technology <laughs> man it looks so wonderful. You got what I'm saying? Now, I am speaking on this Rodecaster Duo, and I am speaking into the, the new Rode um, USB pod mic. Of course, I am on channel one. Let me hit this strip right here. You can see that I'm 50 decimals. Pod mic is selected. I do have the default audio processing on. Let me hit this def the processing. Now, this is what it sounds like with no processing on right now. But what I'm getting ready to do, hopefully you'll see a difference if you have headphones on. Now, if you don't have headphones on, then how are you going to know a difference, man? Come on, man. Put some headphones on. Now, I am telling you to do as I say, not as I do, because I hardly ever wear headphones because I am in a controlled environment you got what i'm saying and when i'm in a controlled environment hey i just want to be controlling in my controlled environment let me hit this processing to turn that processing back on so now in a future video what i'll probably do is i'll probably go through all of these settings and things of that nature but hey i'm not let me hit this presets button hey look at that you hit the presets button i'm gonna hit this neutral button and this is what it sounds like when it's in neutral hopefully you can see a difference or hear a difference and when i say see i mean see with your mind see with your ears you got what i'm saying okay let me hit this podcast studio so this is what it sounds like with the default settings on the Rodecaster Duo, this is Podcast Studio. Now, hopefully, you hear a difference. If you don't hear a difference, it's okay. But what I'm getting ready to do is I'm going to hit this broadcast button. And now I hit the button for broadcasting. Now, this is the broadcast default settings of the Rodecaster Duo. So hopefully, I sound like a broadcaster. If I don't sound like a broadcaster, then guess what? It's okay because I've been a broadcaster before. So I have to sound like a broadcaster to be a broadcaster. Do you understand what I'm saying? Of course you do. Okay, so let me get on out of here. Hit this button right here. I got the processing turned on. Let me hit this home button. Okay, so now I'm going to hit this music bed button. Now... This is what I want you to do. I want you to listen. That's the applause button. Trombone. Air horn. Now, I don't know if you can hear the sound effects. Hopefully you can hear the sound effects. If you can't hear the sound effects, then, oh man, sad face. I ain't, I'm not gonna go through all of those. I just had to show you that we are dealing with 
the Rodecaster Duo. It's that famous uh, rotary encoder button from the Rodecaster Pro 2. This is headphone one, headphone two. Of course, this is channel one, channel two. These are the other channels, of course. This operates that sound pad. This operates the Bluetooth. If you're going to connect a phone and things of that nature, that is where you're going to go to do all of that. I just had to show you that I really have, you know, some people, they'll just talk about um, a piece of technology, but they won't have the actual piece of technology. But this is what it sounds like straight out the box. Just arrived right now. I unboxed it, filmed myself unboxing it, and then I did a video reacting to me unboxing that man. Good grief. And I needed some lotion. You got what I'm saying? I'm just saying, man, that's just how it is. It is what it is. Hey, hey, let's go ahead and transition to the next <laughs> to the next screen right there. OK, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give initial. I'm not doing an official review to me. This Rodecaster Duo is just like the Rodecaster Pro 2. I think that it's a super cool audio solution. And I think that it's designed specifically for a two-man podcast team or a content creator. If you are, let's say that you wanted to create a show and you were just testing mics like this USB mic from Rode, right? You could be speaking on this one mic, have another mic right here, and then talk on that mic. You know, you can use this Rodecaster Duo, and that would be the perfect piece of technology for that type of video. You got what I'm saying? But I think that this Rodecaster Duo, I think that it packs an impressive punch. You got what I'm saying? Because it has so many features, and it's so compact so compact oh my goodness oh you know what hmm, let me let me do this let me go back to this overhead camera right now look at this you see that this is the rode x streamer x 4k capture device you see how small this thing is man that is so cute and so small it's like the rodecaster pro 2 had a baby and here it is now this rodecaster duo is the big brother you got what i'm saying i'm just like man come on man you gotta love that right there man that's just ah, it is just awesome like i said though the duo is awesome it's a very great compact design i think that it's user friendly it's just like the rodecaster pro 2 i'm telling you rode they're in like this apple space where they're creating pieces of technology and they are revolutionizing the industry. So many people are trying to catch up to where Rode was three years ago. You got what I'm saying? And man, they are failing. Um, but Rode is constantly and continuously advancing. You got what I'm saying? I'm just like, man, good gracious. I don't know who's going to catch up with Rode. You know, but anyway, like I was saying, though, I think it's very, this Rodecaster Duo, I think it's very user friendly. I think that it offers a superior sound quality and it is unmatched, especially as it applies to versatility. You can use it for so many different things. I may, I'm going to talk about some standout features of this Rodecaster um, Duo. Of course, it has this ultra low noise, high gain revolution preamp. It has two of those. You got what I'm saying? And it delivers excellent quality, man. I'm telling you. And what I noticed is right out the box, the noise floor for this Rodecaster Duo is excellent. You don't hear a lot of noise, a lot of feedback, I'm telling you. So that means that you're going to have a great recording session. You're going to have crisp, professional sound, crystal clear, and you're not going to have a lot of that unwanted noise. Like if you have an air conditioner in the background or if you got a fan on or any of that type of stuff, I'm telling you, man, you just adjust that, that, that high pass filter, man, you'll be like, man, this is awesome. You got what I'm saying? But look, um, like I said, on the back, on another video, what I'm going to do is I'm gonna, we're probably going to go through and I'm going to point out different pieces and different areas of the Rodecaster Duo, but it has combo jacks, those um, combination inputs, they allow you to input um, a microphone, um, an instrument, a line level device. It has built-in, uh, it has a, like a built-in wireless receiver, right? 
So let's say that you have a Rode series transmitter. That could be the wireless Go 2. It could be the wireless Me. Guess what? This Rodecaster Duo will allow you to create convenient wireless microphone capability. You know what I'm saying? Now, you already saw that it had these individual smart pads, right? And it has seven individually assignable channels. So it has four physical faders and three virtual faders. So that basically means that no matter what you're doing, streaming, just what podcasting, content creation process, whatever you're doing, you have complete control over your audio. And I think that is an excellent quality to have, especially, listen, and then I'm hearing that this has this, um, some type of quad core chip inside of it. You know, I don't really know. I didn't, I haven't taken my Rodecaster Pro 2 or this Rodecaster Duo apart, but I'm hearing that that processor or that motherboard of the Rodecaster Duo, I'm hearing that it's just awesome. It's just like the um, Rodecaster Pro 2. So, hey, you know, of course, it has Apex audio processing. Um, I really like the sound of these Rode products. They are really excellent. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now, I already talked about um, the six programmable smart pads. Um, of course, they can be customized. I didn't even say that. They can be customized. They are customizable smart pads, so you can trigger sound effects. If you got music beds, if you got jingles, if you got other, you can create like a top ten show and and program the the um, the sound effects inside of it. It has this great 5.5 inch um, touchscreen. Now, what I noticed is that the record button is on screen of the Rodecaster Duo. Now, of course, on the Rodecaster Pro 2, it's in the top left-hand corner, but on the Rodecaster Duo, it is in the top left-hand corner of the touchscreen. So, you know, but this high-definition touchscreen is really great, and you can adjust the record button. And I just like the touchscreen, and I just like this Duo, and I like the Rodecaster Pro 2 because you can just kind of navigate. You can easily navigate through so many different settings, you can make the appropriate um, adjustments. I think that the Rodecaster Duo and the Rodecaster Pro 2, I think they're awesome, especially as it applies to uh, connectivity. Um, this Duo specifically though, it offers dual USB-C interfaces. It allows you to connect uh, computers. You can like connect to two computers. You can connect to uh, a computer and a mobile device. At the same time, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying the Bluetooth connectivity, it, it makes it where you can have a, a phone call, right? And then you can integrate that phone call into your podcast recording. I think that's awesome. You can also set up this um, Rodecaster Duo to support multi-track recording. Um, I just think that it's just very flexible. Oh, it has a micro SD card on it. Um, you can also with this US, I don't know about the Rodecaster Pro 2, but with this Rodecaster Duo, you can connect it to a SD card and you can also connect it to external storage. That's right. So you can connect like a T5 or a T7, um, maybe T6. Do Samsung make T6s, T6 external devices? I don't know. I just seen the T5 and I got a T7. So I don't even know they got the T6. I'll just jump right over T6. But anyway, um, you can um, connect a external storage device to this Rodecaster Duo. And I'm just saying, man, that's just, that's great. Now, it has two headphone um, outputs. It has a balanced one-fourth um, line output. So you can connect it to um, monitors. And I'm just saying you can connect it to so many other pieces of technology. You got what I'm saying? So I just think that it's just awesome. Now, what I do like is that Rode is listening to their community of people who are patrons of the products. And what they do is they consistently release firmware updates. You got what I'm saying? So these firmware updates usually give you enhancements or, or, or patches to things that were kind of wonky or going wrong you know what i'm saying so 
they do a great job of providing you with a lot of updates so that you can improve the functionality and the overall experience to your Rode device. So whether you're getting a, a Rodecaster Pro 2 or this Rodecaster Duo, I think that it's a powerful and very versatile audio production device or production studio. And I think it makes it where it's convenient during that recording process because you know during the recording process you're so aggravated so many things are going on so if you're a content creator if you are a podcaster i'm telling you man this thing provides exceptional sound quality it has all these customizable features it's very user friendly and i think that is the best all-in-one solution if you're trying to be creative so if you're trying to get a rollcaster pro 2 i have the rollcaster pro 2 I have this. Uh, I'm I'm speaking right now into the Rodecaster Duo, and you know, I got to keep a stream of X on me, and hey, it just is what it is. Uh, but if you like these types of videos, then please make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, you know, because we just trying to drop these videos. I just try to give you a quick overview and just a good uh, snapshot of the Rodecaster Duo. I'm probably going to be dropping a lot of different videos in the future. But listen, this is what I want you to do. Stay inspired, especially if you at this part of the video right now. Look, stay inspired. Um, just understand that with the right type of discipline, motivation, um, determination, you can do anything that you put your mind to. You got what I'm saying? Man, it got to be logical or reasonable, but you can do almost anything that you put your mind to. You got what I'm saying? So if you really like... Um, technology and if you your goal is to have let's say a podcast studio or a music studio then put a plan in place and work consistently toward that plan you got what i'm saying listen this is inspector tech studio life 10x like comment subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend man shouts out to the wu-tang clan you know what i'm saying and listen man i think i'm done here man you know what I'm saying? Look, man, keep innovating, keep creating, inspire other people. Man, we out of here. Peace, y'all.